What's going on you guys? Welcome back to another video. We are here on a Saturday morning, a beautiful Saturday morning for some golf. Me and Grant, we've been wanting to do this for a little while and uh, the weather's getting nice enough to where we can go out and on a Saturday morning and get some nice golf in. It's currently like what, 52 degrees? So nice morning here at the Elks Country Club in Port West Portsmouth, Ohio. Uh, we got dad over here, but the thing about dad is he's surprising Blaine. Blaine Scott is coming today, which is my buddy that I graduated with. And uh, long, long stories about Blaine and dad and all of us. We have some memories with him, but Blaine does not know dad's here. So we're going to get Blaine's reaction about dad being here, being his caddy. He's going to be his caddy I'm, today. Two silverbacks. Two, know, yeah, the silverbacks. Silver backs. Remember being that? I was talking. It being in one golf cart at the Alps. It's going it, to get rowdy. It, it, it's, it's gonna, gonna get, get rowdy. It's gonna get rowdy. Like I said at the last video at the zoo, the silverbacks with Blaine and Dad. You're about to meet Blaine Scott. You haven't seen him yet in the vlogs, but we got Uncle G back here. So how is Uncle G feeling this morning? Not too bad. Um, Assessing checked, the situation. Yeah, I assessed the situation. I checked the precipitation today, um, the wind speed. Uh, so I think it's gonna be some nice balls. I think we're gonna hit some nice shots today. Uh, greens are looking a little slow because of the dew. Sun's out, so that won't last long. I'm gonna speed up here pretty quick. Other than that, just feeling pretty good. Uh, probably looking at about three or four under today, so it should be a pretty good day today. I mean, the, the look, train's looking. I'm nice. looking out over the horizon, seeing where I can ramp the cart. Right. Yeah, there's a couple That's places a that you can't place hear. Right there, that that'd be. Legit. There's a couple places that you can. Yeah, you can ramp a cart today, definitely at the yeah. Elks. That's kind of hilly, but uh, we're feeling good this morning. We stopped at Tim Hortons. We got our coffees. Uh, got a breakfast sandwich. Me and Dad did. Grant went the healthy route. Uh, got the donut. You know what I mean. <laughs> Hey, he's a cop. He's yeah, a cop. I mean, cop. yeah, he's, he's a big nice. trooper, you know what I mean? But we're going to wait for Blaine to get here. We're going to get his reaction. Once uh, once Blaine gets here, I think we're going to do the whole surprise thing. Me and Grant's going to hop out. Dad's going to stay in the truck, then hop right out, and then he's going to be like, you need a caddy. You know what I mean? So here we go. So we're waiting for Blaine now. So we'll see you in a minute. All right, we're up here we're on the course. Well, Blaine didn't show up today. We don't know where he's at. So you know what? Instead of being the caddy with all my suggestions of what club to use for my – you know, partner Silverback. I'm just gonna sit here and I'm just gonna ride. I, this is the way I'm gonna be like all day. Like you look at me, hole number nine. I'm gonna be sitting the exact same way, just chilling. So Grant's getting all. We gotta get some warmed up right now. We're waiting for these guys. They just took off. But yeah, Blaine didn't show up. So he might. I, you never know. We haven't teed off yet. He might show up super late. But it doesn't look like he's gonna be coming. I can see Blaine. He like hole number three. Like, you know, there'd be a big pond. And Blaine like coming out of the water, like and already having what club he's going to use, and just freaking just drive it over the mountain, over the the mountain, just drive it over top of there, and then just run to get his ball and throw it back. I mean, I can see it. I I personally don't see it happening, but you never know with him right now. So we're going to get teed off here soon. So uh, we have a group of three in front of us, but we're not in no hurry. We're going to take our time. Grant me is going to be some some tour champions today. Grant said three under, I think. That's what he uh, was thinking. So we're going to see how this goes, boys and girls. We'll show you some of the bits in cor uh, of the course. We'll show you some shots. We'll, sh uh, we'll tell you how we're doing today. You know what I mean? I was just to show you guys this hole number one here at the Elks. Beautiful view. It sucks in the morning, though, because when you go to hit, you can hardly see. So you have to have someone definitely spot you. But it's a beautiful golf course. Love coming out here. Um, they take really good pride of their area and their uh, course, so it's really, really nice. So can't wait to show you guys the rest of the course. All right, first hole done. We're uh, one over right now. That's a five on a par four, so looking pretty nice so far. So we got hole number two, which is par five, 508 yards. So we'll go from here. All right, old G had a double on a par five. I had a triple, not a very good hole for me. Uh, but we're going on this right here. Par four, hole number three, 383 yards. Pretty open. Really can't miss anywhere besides the left, it looks like. So hopefully we'll redeem ourselves this this hole right here. All right, G. <laughs> Last See, when I said four under, I meant four over is what I meant. <laughs> well, right now we're on hole number four, par three, 121 yards. Last hole wasn't the greatest in the world either. Uh, I got a triple and he got uh, he double parred. So we're not looking too hot right now, but uh, we're going to get there. You know what I mean? Uh, how you feeling? I'm feeling good. I got my sunflower seeds. That's about it. I still think Blaine's will come out of the water somewhere. <laughs> he might. This is the this is the hole. So 
hole right here as you can tell beautiful hole with water it's very scary but we'll see how we do on this hole the wind's going in front of us <laughs> okay what do you think you ready you ready On the fringe a little bit, but definitely a double shot for him. Still setting himself up if the far. Pitching wedge here. Good pitching wedge. Yeah, like Not teeing it up, hitting from the ground. And in the water. <laughs> and another monogam ball. <laughs> he dropped last hole. He, he dropped. Okay, you're over the water. You're in the sand. In the sand. Oh, he's he made past the sand. He's in the fence. He's in the fence. He's in the fence. Thanks, Dad, for that commentary. Right. So we'll update you guys when we get back over to the green. All right, got Grant right here. Cool. Hard hole. Everything goes downhill. So we're going to see how he does right here. Oh, my God. Dad's watching over there. Oh shoot, Grant! Out a boy, nice shot, big guy. Not bad. Uh -huh. Put this right here because honestly, it's gonna be a it's a hard hole right here, man. Everything goes downhill, so I'm about to put this. Nice little tap. I think I'm gonna aim about a foot outside the cup on the left side. Too hard. Come back. Stop. Really hard hole. I mean, dude, really hard hole right here. Oh, get in the hole. Oh, broke left. Or broke right, man. You know what I mean? Right. Just a little tap in, you know what I mean? Out of boy. Okay. And, uh, left. Going kind of high. Come back around. Oh, my God. So as you can tell, I took a four, Grant took a, what was it, a five? It's double par, right? Oh, double par, you got six, so. Yeah, I took a ball right to the side of the foot. <laughs> so, you know what I mean? Um, that hole wasn't the greatest either. We're kind of we're kind of going downhill. First hole was great, which is honestly weird. And then after that, it's kind of going downhill, but. I did find a ball on that hole, mine. Dad found a ball, so. so. I didn't pay to have to ride, plus I found the ball on my head. Dad's ahead, you know what I mean? We got, next one's a par four. Number five at 343 yards, so short par four. We'll see how this goes. All right, that last hole, I got a bogey and Grant got a double. So it's getting a little bit better. I mean, just kind of some dumb shots that we're getting. Slow down. I found another Slow. golf ball. Dad found another golf ball, so he's feeling good. All right, we got a par four, uh, hole number six, 388 yards. Nice little hole straight away. Uh, there is a dip at the very end down there. There's a dip that goes down, so you really want to clear it. Um, so hopefully we can redeem ourselves on this hole, maybe. Hey, hit the car path, baby. Go on. Big stinger, baby. Good way to start out the hole, right? I mean, straight. Take it. Yeah, all righty, Grant. Low, last hole. We're not looking too hard on the scorecard, so ignore all this. But we had a double bogey on the last hole. We're on a par three. It's long. 191 par three uphill. So it's playing about, I'd say about, it's playing about 205, I'd say. 200. So it's a, it's a good par three right here. It's a, it's a hard one. Well, we're going to get going right here. Hopefully, we can tackle this hole. So, the last hole still wasn't very good. You know what I mean? We and Grant's not playing the greatest right now. That par three was really tough. But we are on number eight, finally. Par five, 457 yards. So, it's a shorter par four. Um, but Grant and Dad are up there on top of the hill because you can hardly see up over this hill to where you're getting hit next so they went up there to check it out but it's a beautiful hole it opens up really big up there once you get past this little mound it's a huge opening and wide open green you have a bunker in the front so we're hopefully hopefully i've said that the whole round hopefully we can uh, do a little bit better on this hole so a lot of room for mess ups on this one i guess me too bad all right big that g last thing. hole grant is 22 over <laughs> 22 over and i am 13 over so we'll see how this goes but we have the last hole it's a par four uh 
number nine, 285 yards uphill, kind of goes down the valley back up to the uh, clubhouse. So kind of a tough, tough hole, but Grant, where are we going to look back on this whole, this game right here? I mean, you had some good shots. You've had solid shots. It's just like me and you both, it's the beginning of the year. You've been out like what, twice this year? Once. Once, and I've been out once. So it's like really for us to come out here, we had good shots to show that we have. Some, I didn't uh, golf at all last summer either. I yeah. golfed one time, I don't think. Yeah, I don't think you did. See, Maybe you once. Here's the thing, boys. I rode around with you guys. I enjoyed the outdoors. I found two golf balls. And I'm even with par. And it didn't cost me nothing. It really didn't, no. No. So, you mean, did a great job, who, so we should be feeling who's good. Who's the winner? Really, mm -hmm. you, if you think about it. That's fine. Me and Grant just kind of – but we're going to get better. We're going to see more of our golf games get better, I swear. Because uh, Grant, he don't have time to go golfing more. I'm I'll, on Monday. Yeah, and plus I don't want to go golfing more. So last hole, we're going to finish up. Like I said, hopefully we can redeem ourselves. Like we've said all all day today, hopefully we can get a decent end the hole with at least – Grant, if you can bogey. end this hole. I want a bogey. You want a bogey? I want a bogey. My, my goal is probably bogeys. Well, I'm going to try par, but I'm going to bogeys good. All righty. Well, golf game is over. Didn't end very well still. Um, Grant shot a 62 and I shot 51. Great day on the course, man. Great day on the course. Um, of course, Dad, he's feeling good. I mean, dude, you came out, I think, even. Two balls. Finished my coffee. Finished coffee. So started, it was a good time. Started good. Yeah, started good. First hole, man, I was really thinking that me and him was going to have a good day. And then second hole was like, eh. And then third hole just got worse. And then just got worse and worse and worse. So I think Grant, I think he said that he's going to be playing a lot more this summer, especially with his time off, him and Kylie. And then I like to play a lot more this summer with Rowan getting a little bit older. I can maybe take him on the course with us, like me, Kylie, and him. And go out with some buddies too as well. So this won't be the last time you'll see us golfing together. Hopefully we can get Blaine next time. Old Blaine, he, he didn't show up, but the silver, the true silverback, the Papa silverback. He, he probably had some business to take care of. He, I think he did. He he probably uh, did some business. He did. He, he's kind of in. Well, I can't say. We can't we can't talk about that stuff right here on this vlog. But so all right, guys. Well, thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys soon.